In this short tutorial, I'm going to show you how I edit my videos in Shotcut. We're going to discuss four different points. First, how to modify the colors via LUTs. Second, how to reduce the noise in the colors. Third, how to correct the lens, basically the bending here of the horizon. And fourth, how to stabilize the video. Let's start. At the beginning, you basically open up your video file. You click on open and your video file or video is going to be shown here. This next step is you drag and drop this video from here to the timeline. And it will appear here in the timeline. Then you click on this timeline that it is highlighted in red and you click on filters. Now we can add the filters. So we all add, we add them all step by step. First, the LUT. Second, we again click on plus and add the noise reduction. I basically use the first one which is HQDN3E. Then we add another filter wire plus called lens correction. And finally we add the stabilize filter. So now we have all four filters and we have to set them up. Let's go back to the LUTs. What are LUTs? LUTs are basically pre-settings how to modify colors. You have to download these LUTs. You'll find um, quite a large number of LUTs in the internet. For example, what I use is if you simply go into Google and Google 35 free LUTs, you'll find here um, 35 LUTs uh, from Rocket Stock, for example. So simply Google for some free LUTs. Download them and save them in a folder. Then we can basically open one of these LUTs to modify the color. We click on Open and uh, we go into the um, shortcut, the 35 free LUTs and we for, can basically, for example, select the first one. And we see immediately the impact, uh, which is not to the better, to the worse. But this is what this uh, filter in this case does, or this LUT. So let's choose another one. For example, um, the um, Fluso, which I um, quite like. If we use that one, okay, the colors have um, quite improved, I would say. You can play around a little bit with the LUTs, um, choose different ones um, as you uh, wish and it might also and will also depend basically on your video. The next step is to reduce the noise in your colors. Um, that can be stipped, skipped, but I usually choose to reduce the noise. Um, if we check here on the histogram on the lower right hand side, you see that we have quite some noise in the colors. You can reduce that noise via this filter. If we activate it, you see, okay, it has already been reduced. You can increase that or even smooth that further as you like. The third point is the lens correction. It's basically the bending here of the horizon. Um, how you can do that is simply by um, setting up a value uh, below 50 here in the correction at center. So if we move that to the downside here, um, then you see that um, the horizon is being corrected. It comes with um, you know a uh, drawdown, which is basically that the edges are cut, and also you will see here some blurring. Um, anyhow. Um, there's a certain trade-off um, between um, correcting the horizon and, you know, not um, cutting off too much of it. 
I have some presettings in my case which are 32.5 um, but depending on your camera you probably want to choose a um, different value. The last point um, is to stabilize the video. Um, this is a two-step process. The first step is to analyze the video. Um, I take the maximum possible value for shakiness and accuracy, which are 10 and 15. And then um, basically I stabilize the video by smoothing um, the uh, picture. So I usually choose the value of 25. You can play around with that one as well. After that, um, you basically can analyze um, your video um, in the first step. So you click on analyze and save these, um, this analysis analysis um, somewhere, just give it a random file name and what will happen is basically that um, a job is started uh, which you can see down here which um, might take quite a while depending on your video. Simply wait um, until this job has finished and after the job has finished you can click on export export file and then save your videos with all your filters um, somewhere. Uh, but for that simply wait uh, for that job otherwise the um, 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 stabilization filter cannot be applied. I hope this video has helped you. Um, simply have a try and enjoy. Thank you very much.